Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem six in chapter seventeen. Chapter seventeen is about temperature, thermal expansion, ideal gas law. There we talk about alcohol in glass thermometers. As we can see, there must be linear relationship between alcohol column length with the temperature, right? So we can see the two points are given. First point is this one when the temperature is zero and the column's length. Is eleven point eighty two. When the temperature become one hundred degree, the length of columns is twenty one point eight five centimeter. And now we need to find another two point at a different column lengths A and B, right? To find the corresponding length. For so for this one, uh, we can find the function to describe this linear relationship between temperature and alcohol columns lengths. So you can see first one we can get the slope. So for slope uh, tangent theta, we just use delta t divided by delta l. Agree, delta t divided by delta l. We get an answer there. Then we choose this point as the initial point and find the function for temperature with the column's length. We can write it as this one. Now things become super easy. For case A, you just input the l as 18.7 cm and get, get the corresponding temperature at there. For the case B, we input the L as 14.6 cm at there and get the answer there. Thank you.